outside the young man's house where he did say no comment, but added that he would release the footage one day on his TikTok and his Snap in hopes of getting on, and I quote, dancing with the stars on God. Now, for our final story, I'd like to say happy Thanksgiving to everybody. If you're going to be celebrating with your family and friends, please be safe, be responsible, and remember, this is about the time we spend with everyone, because all we have left in this life, once we're gone, is the legacy we leave behind. I've been Winston Quattlebaum, you've been amazing, and I will see you when I see you. All right, Gary, we couldn't get the kid to walk out for a second? I mean, seriously. All right, let's pack it in. I have people coming over at my house. Any questions about my report? What did you just show us? Winston, I'm glad you assembled us all here, but I gotta be honest, I don't know what the point of any of that was. Never mind whatever that was. I'm glad you invited us all here, but I can't shake the fact that I know you live here alone. I keep thinking that someday you'll die in here and no one will find you because nobody will check on you. I assume that was some sort of distraction so we don't notice your pathetic uh, living situation. Wait just one minute. How are you there and here at the same time, Daddy? I was explaining to you all why I gathered us back together for the holidays after our very long hiatus. Didn't you say we were all coming back in September? Coming back in September? Uh, I never said that. Somebody else said they were returning in September. I can assure you that wasn't me. That was a fantastic idea, brother, and a wonderful weather report you just did. Uh, Pastor, I'm not a wet. When is the catering getting here? Whoever the caterers are, Daddy, be prepared to send it back. Why? Because nothing's good enough for the world champ. Demondrius, you're my family, so I'll be very upset when I have to finally put you in a home. But full transparency, I'll also be very relieved. Ah, uh, well, Mono said he would do the catering, but instead he showed up with nothing. I never said I would provide catering. I said I would charge you all for catering. Nobody paid me. Therefore, no catering. Wait, so you knew there was no food here because you were supposed to bring it, but weren't planning on bringing it, but you came here anyway. Is there a reason for this? Because my wife and my kids, they know here. I want to ask you where your wife and kids are, but my body is racked with fear whenever I speak to you, so I'm just gonna pray for them instead. Thank you, Pastor. I am constantly warning everyone about Mono De Negro and his schemes, but nobody listens to me. Big Tony, you have said time and time again that you still dabble in criminal behavior, so we don't really ever know when you're being honest. Almost never, but come on, why is he even standing? Tactical advantage and intimidation. Respect, Daddy. Oh, this is gonna end with us not eating on Thanksgiving, isn't it? I'll tell you this right now, if that happens, I'm going to go on Facebook and make a personal attack for each and every single one of you. While you're attempting to make personal attacks through social media that no one will care about because your circle is small, I will go and find food in another house with much better decorum and finer company. So, adios! Can I come? Absolutely not! Don't worry, gentlemen. I will think of something. Allow me to call in some favors.